Hi, ladies, gentlemen, and pups of all ages, including teenagers or so on. If there's any profanity, not profanity like nudity or anything like that, you don't have to worry about that. I'm going to make this basically to the point and try to stay on focus like I always try to do, but sometimes never get done. Um... This is Jackrabbit35, and I'm basically coming to you guys. I sent out the two gifts to uh, Melissa Nails Clicks. Thank you very much. I appreciate your gift, and I know that it came out of your pocket, and I'm I'm very um I have it still on my flag over there. It's probably you probably can't see it. But it's hanging off the part of the green one next to the yellow. If you can see that little thing over there. Um, and I do wear it so sometimes when I go out. So, um, But I always put it back on my big flag. Um, and to... Uh, who is the... Uh, she has a really long name so I can't memorize it. Um... But I gave her her gift, and it mailed out, and I gave my sister, my twin, a gift. And my sister Sharon from Sharon's Nail Boutique, she will use it when she needs it. Because her customers do like my glitters mixes, but they haven't used them yet. So whenever they want to use them, they'll let me know. Um... This is kind of a downer for me, but, you know, I have to basically, I'm probably going to be vlogging like I normally do. Um, it's past 3.30, I think, in the morning. I'm having a lot of issues with my weight and my, my health, basically. My health is very poor. And this is not me boasting or anything like that. So, because I know some people think, oh, if you talk about it, it's boasting. Or it's bragging. Or something else. You know, I'm not trying to tell people just to either show off or to make more awareness of it. But my weight and my health is very bad. Um... I don't know until the next blood test about my cholesterol, but all I know is that it's very close to 400, and my white blood cell count is very high. Um, I try to take as best care of my body as possible. Um, somehow, my eating disorder that was in the past is still acting up to this day, and... I am on and off again very sick. Like, it just happens out of nowhere where I'll get sick. And I can't keep food down. So, I won't be able to make as many videos as I would like. And most of them will, basically, they'll be all vlogs like they have been. So, you know, um, tomorrow, hopefully, I'll be able to finally sit down with my, my nephew and... And watch some scary movies like he likes to watch. Um, I have a f quite a few. I have a good selection of scary movies. Including my favorite which is Puppet Master. My favorite puppet in that movie is the Jester. Where he has sections. Like his from his nose to his top lip has a split. And from his nose with his eyes there's a split. There's like three sections. And whenever he shows a, an emotion, they change to show what how he's feeling or what he's responding to. And it, he's a, like a, he's a jester um, from like medieval ages, but he's not from the medieval ages. He was just created to be like that, and he used to be, basically the puppet master puts the souls or parts parts of the person that he cared about into the puppets. So that he knows who they are when they were human. And so he will be friends with them. 
you know, some of them were Nazis and some of them were vill like bad guys, but they always listened to him. But in, in the, like the last one, they ended up killing him because he went kind of overboard. Um, he really went full throttle on that. He turned himself into a, basically a mannequin and they didn't agree with it and they didn't really like what he was doing so they ended up killing him. And then went with the next best thing which was another guy and he, they took, he took care of them. But um, I'm hoping that my nephew likes the movie because he likes scary movies like Freddy Krueger, Jason Voorhees, uh, Michael Myers, Chucky, and um, for I think his birthday, I got him the box set, which has uh, from the first Child's Play all the way to Ch Cult of Chucky, and now there's a new Chucky movie coming out. It never seems to end, <laughs> and you know I. Like I do a lot in these vlogs, they always lead on to being a long vlog and I end up having to erase it and redo it and redo it and redo it and redo it to try to make it short. But I'm having a lot of issues with making videos because I make them too long because I just keep on gabbing like I am now. But I'm, I'm going to attempt to go and get some sleep, but... You know, I'm just worried about my health and my mental well-being. And I'm just really depressed and very lonely. We'll basically leave that alone, though. The loneliness. Um, I just had to clear my thoughts there. So, yeah. I I think all the women that I know know what loneliness means. And they've lost loved ones before. But losing a partner is even a harder one. And especially when you lose a loved one that broke up with you and then tries to find you and then just gives up on himself and can't he can't he couldn't find me and he just gave up on himself gave up on me gave up on his family and gave up on medicine and he didn't take it and it basically led to him dying and he was my first one that I ever was with that long. I was with him for two years before he broke up with me. And I always thought that we would make a great couple. You know, we loved everything the same. He, he was my polar bear. And that was his nickname for him. Because he was like six foot something and like close to 500 pounds. So he could have made a really good big ass male polar bear and he was very protective over me he wasn't overprotective he wasn't abusive he wasn't mean verbally he wasn't verbally abusive or anything he was very confused he was manipulated into believing that i was cheating on him when my parents never taught us to cheat on our loved ones and some of the some of my siblings did cheat on their loved ones, but I stood I stood by my my boyfriend until I was forced to move out of Meriden and to somewhere where I was not used to. And to this day, I will never forgive that person that made me move. Because they basically ruined my life. And any chance of me being very, very happy. And, you know. So if you guys have any comments down below. You know. You know I, I just hope that I find happiness again. And, you know. 
I hope you guys do come back. I know that I haven't been really honest with you guys and didn't stick to getting eight people on the giveaway and you guys did unsubscribe and you guys were probably mad and everything like that and I'm very, very sorry. Just a lot of family stuff was going on and it was just too much and it, it just kept me occupied for so long that I didn't realize that you guys were there and I am very, very sorry. I apologize deeply and I am so, so sorry. And I hope you can forgive me and I hope you do come back and, you know, to our pack and, you know, Jesus, I think I would be on the Guinness World Records for changing the, my name of my channel for so many times. You know, that would be a cool thing. <laughs> I think I was the first one on YouTube to change her name like seven times already or more. So, you know, that would be awesome. But I got to go to bed and hopefully I can sleep. I had like three cups of cappuccino so <laughs> earlier today, yesterday, so... I hope I can sleep and, you know, hopefully I can maybe think of him and he can, like, maybe I can imagine him laying next to me and maybe I can sleep, you know. So hopefully you guys have a good night and a good day and everything like that and I'll probably make a video again tomorrow night or or tonight, not right now after this one, but you know what I mean. I'll talk to you guys later. Um, I'm sorry for everything, the whole mess up and everything, but it will never happen again. I promise you guys, okay? Um, I think the channel is mainly going to be vlogs and basically showing my artwork um, that I try to do, okay? I'm not going to be doing any more glitter mixes, and, um, yeah, I think the glitter is just going to be basically used probably on my body, like, just to play around with, you know, so, um, if you guys want to buy any glitter from me, I have a wide variety of glitter, um, so, yeah, um, I'll talk to you guys again. Love you guys. Remember, we are a pack. We are strong. Love you guys. Bye.